how do you stay relevant and keep re-innovating yourself so you stay relevant, especially in the communication world? All I have done, Daniel, is listen and pay attention um, and be in the shoes of young people and watch what they're putting out and read what they're writing listen to their cries for help in multiple ways on movies or TV shows or social media or podcasts or things. Just read and listen and key in to what they're talking about. When I have young people in Q&A, the, the nature of the questions they ask and the way in which they ask them um, and their attachment to the outcomes of the answers that we provide. And I think that's been, not, I don't just do that so I can sort of, um, appear contemporary. I do that because uh, any organization, business, political party, if they don't do some version of that, Daniel, where we're constantly um, listening to the future, because that's what these kids are, they're the future. If we're not listening to their concerns and what matters most to them and what they aspire to be and become, uh, then we're going to fade into irrelevance whilst claiming we're very relevant and a lot of organizations are hugely irrelevant and know that, but they bolt things on that are trendy. <laughs> mm -hmm. 